Hey, what's up you guys? In today's video, I want to talk to you about some 2019 updates. Uh, I just want to go through what I'm going to change for this year and what my plans are and some predictions I think could help you uh, in your reskinning uh, career. So let's get right into it. Uh, so my biggest thing probably for this year is that I'm not only going to do iOS reskins anymore, I'm going to try to get into a 50-50 Android and iOS to kind of diversify things. Um, towards the end of 2018, I did a couple of my first Android reskins, and they actually went very well. So I'm kind of changing my thoughts on uh, doing only iOS because iOS has gotten a little bit more difficult too. So I think it's great to have a bit of a 50-50 there and um, just do a couple of different things. And I think that'll help me do a lot more reskins in a month and uh, really increase my revenue. So I recommend if you're reskinning right now or want to get into it, to definitely do some Android and some iOS because that'll help you earn a lot more than if you do only Android or if you do only iOS. Because iOS reskins will get you more money, but you're able to res uh, reskin more Android apps uh, very quickly because the review process isn't as rigorous. So that'll help you get a lot more apps out and earn more money. Um, in addition to that, I'm wanting to do some more Amazon reskins. Like I've said before in different videos, uh, the difference between Amazon reskins and Android and iOS reskins is that Amazon reskins are more long term because you're not selling them on Flippa. Basically what you do is find apps that are very popular in the iOS app store and uh, see if they're not in the Amazon app store yet and then publish them into the Amazon one and eventually make them a paid app and you can make like $500 to $1,000 per month doing this and it's more of a long-term strategy because every month you can be making money from it. Uh, even one Amazon app that I reskinned a long time ago, uh, the Dunes app, which isn't even popular anymore, it's still making me about $30 a month and at one point was making me $500 a month. Uh, so you'll earn money consistently from those apps for a long time. I actually just purchased uh, a package of about 40 Am uh, their Android apps, but I'm gonna turn them into Amazon apps. And I'll let you guys know how that goes. I've already released a few of them, and so far it's going pretty well. But I'll keep you updated on that. Uh, in addition to that, I want to increase my freelancing business. Um, to do that, I'm going to start doing more email marketing and also do some Facebook ads for that. So if any of you guys are into freelancing, I would definitely recommend starting to do some email marketing uh, because that works very well. I know a few of my students have started freelancing already, uh, so definitely look into that because I started doing that towards the end of 2018 and it increased sales a lot. Uh, so it's definitely very effective and I want to try to experiment with Facebook ads because it works for other businesses pretty well. Uh, I'm not sure how it'll convert for uh, a development kind of business. So I just got to test that out and I'll let you guys know how that goes. As you know, in 2018, freelancing was about 50% of my business. So I want to increase that even more. Uh, hopefully maybe 75% of my income will be freelancing uh, this year. Uh, but who knows, maybe my reskinning income will increase too. So uh, I'll keep you guys updated on that. Uh, one of my biggest plans for 2019 is to create a new marketplace for buying and selling apps. As many of you already know, the prices on Flippa have increased and uh, it's kind of annoying for many reskinners because that's really digging into profits, that $25 listing fee. Uh, although the success fee has dropped from 15% to 10%, um, that $25 listing fee really hurts a lot of people because it used to be $9. So I'm hoping by the end of 2019, I can have at least a beta for my new marketplace that will compete with Flippa. And uh, I think it'll be much better than Flippa. I already have some designs done and um, it's looking really great. The interface is much better than Flippa's and we're gonna have much better prices. And uh, hopefully a beta will be out by the end of 2019. And I'm gonna invite all you guys so you can test it out first. Uh, hopefully within like the next few months, I can release some designs 
or maybe like a very basic website that people can check out and uh, review and help us improve the website. So I'm very excited about that because I think that'll help a lot of people and um, it, it's going to be a big project, but I think it'll turn out great. So in addition to that, I want to start selling templates uh, to all my students and to anyone who watches these YouTube videos, or anyone who comes across them uh, for like maybe around $47 uh, so people can get started with reskinning very cheaply. These will be templates where they have the full rights to. It's not going to be like a single license or anything. Like Once you get the template, you can do whatever you want with it just for $47 because I know a lot of people are, are strapped for money and uh, they can't afford these like $500 like Chupa Mobile multi-license multi e-commerce apps. So I want to start releasing some free skins that I created myself and uh, have used successfully. Um, with some guides to help you guys reskin them for a pretty cheap price and that'll probably be on my Applico Market website. I'm going to slowly upload some apps uh, as I go along this year and as I create some more new ones and I hope that'll help a lot of you guys out because uh, I think the course has been helping a lot of people out, helping them earn money and some of you kind of don't want to get into the course because you think you can learn on your own which is great and something like a template might be uh, better for your money, especially if you have a very tight budget. Um, so another thing that I'm trying to do in 2019 is create a new course for you guys. Um, I'm not sure exactly what people need the most help with, but I was thinking something like Swift programming with like an app reskinning kind of twist. So I'm not going to get very deep into um, the iOS like Swift programming techniques. I want to teach everyone just enough so they can reskin and like get on their feet really quickly and start making money. Uh, so I'm going to just teach stuff like how to create table views, how to like create a back end for your app, how to create accounts, uh, basically everything you really need to make a great app that you can reskin or reskin existing templates. Uh, another idea I had was a Photoshop app because Photoshop, or not a Photoshop app, a Photoshop course because photoshopping is pretty important in reskinning apps. Um, it's pretty essential for creating icons or screenshots uh, and like things like buttons or any graphics within the app. Um, I'm kind of leaning more towards Swift programming course, but if you guys really want to Photoshop one, let me know and I can change my mind on that. Uh, finally, my last goal for this year is to create more emoji apps. Uh, in previous years, like in 2017 and even last year, I've had quite a bit of success with the emoji apps that I've made and I only see emojis getting more popular and I want to create more of them and uh, just keep them as my own mostly. I've sold a lot of emoji apps before and I've kind of regretted it because they're pretty good for making long-term income, but uh, I plan to release some more emoji apps just to increase my revenue uh, that I know I'm going to get each month um, just by app sales or in-app purchases. That's about it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video and learned about some of the things I'm going to be doing in 2019. And uh, maybe you can make use of some of these things and put that into your 2019 plan too. Uh, I'm really excited for what this year has to come. And uh, I'm going to get start, started working right now. And before you guys leave, I just want to remind you that the app course is still on sale for $47 until tomorrow. Uh, after tomorrow, it'll be back up at $197. So if you're interested in that, be sure to buy it right now. Uh, besides that, uh, that's all I have for today. Thanks for watching, guys.